All right, guys, this is how the plate looks like. This is what I'm doing. Gotta trim this one all the way. And then we gotta trim this too, just a little bit in order for the hollow sun to fit on this plate. This is the number two plate from Springfield. You'll see it later, the number is right here somewhere. We'll be back shortly, but yeah, using a Dremel with the stone wheel and just dremeling. I didn't tape it when I started, so I scratched it first a little bit, but if you want, you can use, I believe it's called the, the bluing, and you can paint, touch up this, this plate. From the back of the screw, it will be visible. The scratches will be visible when you put the Holosun 407 or 507K. But we'll be back shortly.